composition of the atmosphere. The air we breathe in is a mixture of many gases. Nitrogen and oxygen gas make up the bulk of the atmosphere. Carbon dioxide, helium, ozone, water vapor, argon hydrogen and dust are found in lesser quantities. 78% of air is nitrogen. Along with air, we inhale nitrogen into our lungs and exhale it. Plants need nitrogen in large amounts, but they cannot take nitrogen directly from the air. Nitrogen-fixing bacteria that live in the soil and roots of some plants convert atmospheric nitrogen into form usable by plants. 21% of air is oxygen. Humans and animals take oxygen from the air as they breathe. Green plants produce oxygen during photosynthesis. In this way, oxygen content in the air remains constant. If we cut trees, then this balance gets disturbed. Green plants use carbon dioxide during photosynthesis and release oxygen. Carbon dioxide oxygen balance is disturbed by burning of fossil fuels as this adds billions of tons of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere each year. The increased volume of carbon dioxide affects the Earth's weather and climate. Carbon dioxide released in the atmosphere creates a greenhouse effect by trapping the heat radiated from the earth. It is therefore called a greenhouse gas and without it the earth would have been too cold to live in. However, when atmospheric carbon dioxide level increases due to factory smoke or car fumes, the heat retained increases the temperature of the earth. This is called global warming. Rise in temperature due to global warming causes the snow in coldest parts of the world to melt. As a result, the sea level rises, flooding the coastal areas. Drastic climate changes may lead to extinction of some plants and animals in the long run.